let's take a scenario that we are working on a multi-tier application currently we have three tiers a front end which is built in angular the api which is built in java and the back end is mongodb our testing team wants to set up this multi-tier application on their local desktop in order to test our applications uh, setting up multi-tier application on a local machine by testing team can be done with manual procedure it will take lot of time and it will be inconsistent now i don't want that kind of mess to set up multi-tier applications i want to set up this in a single command that can be done using docker compose so docker compose is a tool where we describe all the details about our uh, microservices or uh, the containers in single command the compose will read all those details described and it will set up on a local machine let us uh, quickly walk through a docker compose file for uh, setting up this three tier app the version we are pointing to is uh, 2 under services we have service 1 name of the service it can be any name i am calling it fe which stands for front end for setting up front end this is the image it has to pull and a container name is this and port mapping followed by the network it has to use when it is uh, installed on the local machine the second microservice is mongodb container name the image network we are using volumes because even if mongodb container terminates i want data to be persistent and the third microservice is api which is built using uh, spring boot again same container name the image to use the port mapping and the network volumes i am creating a volume for mongodb as i said uh, data stored in mongodb should be persistent even if that container gets terminated I want all these applications to run on a single network so I am also declaring a network which creates Java Home app network using bridge driver. So this is our docker compose file if our testing team wants to set up this multi-tier application what they have to do is they have to download this file into their local machine. I have given instructions in our uh, github page so copy that link. So using that command download docker compose file followed by write execute docker compose app d this will bring uh, all microservices declared inside compose file and because of minus d all these apps will run in the background. So docker compose app minus d it reads the docker compose file we just downloaded and see what it does there it has created a network and it has created three containers using three different images if you go and check docker ps you can see three containers up and running which joined a same network because i want these three applications to communicate that's why I created bridge network and I joined these three containers onto a same network. If you have seen this in single command, all our applications, right, up and running on local machine and it's easy to test now. So after, uh, what is that? Uh, bringing up your microservices, open your browser and run this. If you see, I have this application which is my front end when I add any data here let me add employee with ID 4 add data goes to API and API in turn talks to what is that uh, MongoDB and persist data into MongoDB so this is a very quick video on how docker compose works with an example of a three-tier application Thanks for watching.